Okay, so, the Mighty Musashi. I've played a few games, and as you can tell by that thumbnail, I've got a spicy game for you guys. So, let's have a chat. As most of you know, Musashi is the sister of Yamato. We've got the iconic 18-inch guns with the same reload damage and of course the same overmatch capabilities. If you don't have an icebreaker, Musashi will punch right through your bow, so bow tanking is a no-no. Overmatch applies to deck armor as well, so 32mm French boys, stay away from Musashi. You still have the god tier torpedo protection, as well as the very exposed Citadel too. Apart from that, Musashi is quite different to Yamato. The most obvious change is the accuracy. Shell grouping took a big hit, and you now have Japanese dispersion instead of US dispersion. At long range, it won't feel that different, but at close to mid range, you're really gonna feel it. <laughs> AA is of course a joke too. Carriers will go out of their way to farm you, so it's important to try and stick with your team for AA cover. We all know how carriers work though. If a carrier wants you dead, you're gonna die. Your massive health portal of damage farm is salivating too. I know I'm looking forward to the final week of the update to farm 5 Musashis every game. When used correctly though, this health pool will make you a tough nut to crack. So overall, Musashi is balanced by turning the RNG factor up to 10. I do think that's the best way to balance these guns, but getting farmed by carriers and HE spammers, having your shots splice or just overpen, it's a frustrating experience for sure, but when Musashi wants to work, it's naturally very strong. The aim of the game is to stay at range and just keep pumping out these massive shells. The 25 second reload definitely makes up for the odd crappy salvo you get. Here's the build I've gone with. Fairly typical build, although I've gone with draw bits for that extra damage boost. Since the accuracy is unreliable, when my shells actually hit, I want them to hit as hard as possible. Taking the max damage from 14.8k to 16.2k is worth it in my book. Oh yeah, Cunningham is a must pick. We get 5% shell grouping from him, then another 5 from Flammable Cannoneer, and then another 10% with the Spotter Plane. Combined, that should pretty much take us to a Margie accuracy. Alright, let's go. Okay, we're on Crash Zone. Not really anything scary on the red team. All depends on where that Yugamo spawns, or whether that Karga wants to focus me or not. Chances are he probably does, but you never know. So yeah, push up to this island and see what pops up. Oh man, that's too tempting. Yes. Oh, come on Musashi, work with me here. He's still sailing broadside for some reason, but I'll take it. Oh no, that looks really good. Ooh, okay. I may as well just end the video. That's Musashi in a nutshell right there. You either get shafted or you do 50k damage salvos. No in between. Let's keep these guns going though. Stationary Iowa looks good. Nice accuracy again. 15k, not bad. Not great this time. Still get 7k though. No way is this Vanguard just going to sail out broadside again. What a mad lad. These are going to fall short though. Still get a Citadel though, I'll take it. Musashi gets the finish too, nice one whale. Hipper next. Another Citadel, go again. See ya. This is looking quite nice, you know. Yes. Iowa, he's smart enough not to go broadside, apparently. Wow, lucky to get 10k there. Let's get some shells into this boring ass Republic player. This guy's bow tanking as if he's a Jean Bart. Oh, brother! Eh, no source. Ooh, Lion. No shot is he gonna do this. Oh man, you're too kind. Now that's a lot of damage. Good, pop a heal as well, I dare you. Yup, beautiful. I was going for a flank, okay, let's get moving. Go for the overmatch shot. Boop, that's 200k. Should be clear from this Iowa now. Let's get this uh, Republic gone. Oh, here's the Karga as well. Oh, this could be big. Kill the Karga and ram the Republic, maybe? Seven K. <laughs> and he's dead already? Man, we only got seven K damage from that Karga, that's rough. Right, kill the Republic and that should be at least 250 K.
Wow, he fired. Okay. Let's try and tickle him a bit and then try and get a shot into his eye before the game ends. Okay, good. No, teammate. He's too low now. Secondaries, no. Please. No, not a fire. No. Oh, man. That should have been 300k for sure. It's been a fat while since I've hit 300k too. Oh, well. That's still a great result for Misashi. I still think most of you guys will get frustrated and hate it, but you should still get it for sure. 2,500 doubloons for such an iconic ship is a steal. Alright guys, take care, see ya.